New information tonight about an alleged deadly drug deal between three teens. Thanksgiving night, it outlines in a new filed document. A 19 year old shot and killed two 17 year olds charged with his murder. Fox News' Morella Porter joins us live at MPD headquarters. And Morella, what more can you tell us? Shelby, those records show that the two 17-year-olds now charged with murder allegedly met up with the victim to sell him marijuana, and that's when bullets started flying. Deadly details written out in these newly filed court documents, revealing a drug deal turning violent on Thanksgiving night. 19-year-old Tavon Holder shot and killed near his family home off of Old Pascagoula Road. Court records show the two 17 year old suspects charged with his murder allegedly met up with Holder to sell him marijuana. According to those documents, Anthony McPherson is accused of shooting Holder twice in his back and Lucy Rutledge is accused of assisting McPherson. Stunned by her son's death, allegedly at the hands of another teen, Natasha Miles telling Fox 10 News she forgives them and her thoughts are with their families who are also suffering. My heart goes out to them right now because they're kids. I'm not cold hearted. I'm crying for them too. And I'm like, why? District Attorney Ashley Rich sending a stern message to other teens about the choices they make. This case is a perfect example uh, to especially young people in the community that if you commit a class A felony, a violent felony offense, um, even at the age of 17, you're charged as an adult uh, and you go to adult jail and you go uh, face adult charges. Both teens have also been charged with unlawful distribution of a controlled substance. Now, Rutledge and McPherson are out on bail tonight. They'll be back in court tomorrow. Live in Mobile, Morella Porter, Fox 10 News.